close out here? Let's close out on this, man. Let's Okay. Stop picking dudes mm -hmm. that you can run over. Yeah. Okay? Mm -hmm. Stop getting guys that are just coming with you just to come with you. Mm -hmm. Okay? You have you're already valuable. Mm -hmm. You're already beyond I wanna say beyond valuable. Yeah. So every it doesn't matter what guy says you look good mm -hmm. that's not that's not the point mm -hmm. the point is because there's gonna be 50 other guys that say the same thing just to get one goal done yeah get in bed okay get in bed with you exactly that's it that's not the goal and, and it's and it's a million other people that are, there's many other guys that say the same thing mm -hmm. So I feel like sometimes you have to pick a guy that says something a little bit different. Yeah. And who you observe who is different. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of times you're looking at the playboy, the person who you who perceive has this money and all this good stuff. But look about the look at the potential an individual has. Right. And then this is the thing is you gotta shape you really when you when I think about relationships, you're really marrying yourself. You know what I'm saying? You're marrying somebody who reflects some of the same characteristics that you already have. So if you're getting a certain amount of individuals, a certain amount of, of you is in them. Some things that you like and some things that you don't like. Because yeah. you know the whole situation is with this whole Adam and Eve thing, God took the rib out of Adam. So the woman came from Adam. So there's certain aspects of Adam and Eve that are similar together because they, they're together. Mm. You gotta find your rib. Your rib has to reflect who you are. So you want to get a better person? Mm. Change who you are. And you're going to attract the individual that you want. If you want a person with character and integrity and all these other things, don't expect that out of somebody else if you're not willing to do the same thing. And there it is. Big questions. Can you work on your relationship the way you work at work? Wow, that's deep. Now, are you going to put in that time yeah. to work with that guy that you really know mm. is a good a good man with a good character mm -hmm. or a good person let's just let's say person man mm -hmm. you know um are you going to work with that person to to make it work in this relationship if you're not if you're not going to work mm -hmm. if you could go and work for somebody mm -hmm. for 40 hours a week mm -hmm. and give them all the grace of making you have to wake up mm -hmm. and making you leave their place of work when True. you finish working mm -hmm. what type of grace are you going to give your partner Oh, bro, that's deep, bro. Okay. Yeah. Number uh, another one. Stop crucifying these guys for telling you what they want. Mmm. I don't care if he told you. The problem is, it's not you. Mm. That's the problem. Does mm. that when some guys explain to you mm. what they want, mm. some women are so upset mm. that it's. They're just upset because it's not who they are. Mm. Like I'm not that, so you you can't you can't have it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You shouldn't have it. You should be shamed to not want that. Mm. Like the guy we were talking about on the post who yeah. got shamed for um, not wanting, to date, not wanting to date single mothers. Yeah. And this lady sat up in her chair like King Pumba and was like, mm. "You're doing too much." Yeah. Like what? He explain. He ex went on to explain why he doesn't mm -hmm. want to date single mothers. He has his own trauma mm -hmm. and issues that's attached to that. That's attached to that. That's his design. And you know what these panel women said to him? Mm -hmm. You are wrong mm -hmm. for wanting what you want. For wanting life. what you want. For explaining yourself, mm -hmm. you're wrong. Another, no, another reason why you're single is when a guy tells you what he wants, you tell him he's wrong. Mm. How yeah. are you going to tell me I'm wrong for wanting what I want? Exactly. And then there's the thing is, you have to allow for an individual to have their opinion. And it seems like society makes it this way, so women already conform to like, this is how it is. It's not how it is because, you know what, there's more women than there are men. So that means that men have wider choices they don't have to pick you you know what i'm saying they right. can pick somebody else and they can have children even far past their prime past your prime so that's what women a lot of women but understand. dirt yeah 
These these women are out here single mothers. You're not gonna give them a chance, Dirk. <laughs> Are you so you're telling me mm. the problem the problem is they mm. want you to be mm. when they when they when you explain yourself they want you to be Mr. Nice Guy. Yeah. But then when they need protecting, yeah. they want you to be Superman. Yeah. They want you to be a bad boy. They want you to be a bad boy. Mm. Then they want you to be they sensitive. Want, they don't want you but then I want you to be yeah. sensitive yeah. enough you. to know when to be hard on me. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is, bro. Or be sensitive not to be a and to be too sensitive that they're too feminine because women don't like to see feminine qualities in a man that they want to expect to be they masculine. Want you, they want you and that's a don't feminine quality. Don't say right? things I don't want to hear. And see, that's the thing. You got to learn how to say, you got to accept when a man says no to you. I think they respect you. You got to accept when somebody, when the person that is yeah, in that. charge of that situation says yeah. no. Yeah. You say no. Exactly. Like there are things that my wife does better than I do. I say go ahead. You get in yeah. front. Do it. Handle this. I got your back. Yeah. When yeah. you get back, yeah. you won't have to do yeah. none of this over here. Because I got this. Mm -hmm. You do this best. But you know, why would I not why would I send in my why would I send in myself exactly. to go do this when I know you're better at this? Exactly. You know it's so interesting that you should say that. I was I was talking to a friend of mine. He was saying to me, his wife will criticize him for something she told him to do. <laughs> so this is what we're talking about. Be Mr. Nice Guy, told, but be Superman at the same time. Be the badass. She told him to do because she's in, indecisive. And that's one thing as a woman that you gotta recognize. You can't be indecisive. You gotta learn how to make decisions too. You can be indecisive all you want. Be it over there though. Yeah. Be it in your head. Yeah. Come tell me mm -hmm. what you got going on. Mm -hmm. Let's handle it together. Yeah. Your indecisiveness mm -hmm. is you fighting yourself. You know you're right about something, but you don't want to be. Yeah. Yeah. You know what you you know what you need to do, but you don't <laughs> yeah. want to do it. Yeah. Yeah. So you're back and forth with it. Yeah. And that that can be really frustrating to a dude. Yeah. But that's that's in people. That's with people in a relationship already. Correct. If you're not in a relationship, relationship don't do my guys that are still here. Don't mm -hmm. listen to don't don't do that anymore. Don't mm -hmm. deal with any any women that are indecisive. Yeah. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. You don't, no problem. Stop. T t t stop. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You're if you don't have the foresight mm -hmm. and you can't see in front of you mm -hmm. a woman that's indecisive in her ways, mm -hmm. then you got some work to guys have some work to do too. You True. gotta step back, man, and, and start yeah. analyzing everything that you're going through and everything that you're getting ready to do. Yeah. So that you can see what <laughs> you yeah. can see the minefield in front of you yeah. before you were before you are attached, before you are aligned, before your souls, before you sign that sheet of paper, yeah, you need to know. Mm. You, you both need to know what you're getting into. Exactly, you need to have focus. You can't have focus if one person's like. But that was weird to me. Is like he was saying that he is getting crucified for a decision she told him to do. He made a decision. She said, "I want you to do this." He did it, and then gets criticized for it. That's see, this is a whole another marriage conversation. Yeah, yeah, that's but that's thing. yeah. That's his fault. Yeah, of course. I don't let personally, I don't I don't I don't like when that happens. Uh -huh. And sometimes it does. Mm -hmm. And sometimes it, it as a married man, it's mm -hmm. kinda laid on you. Yeah, of course. Okay? Mm -hmm. Because you picked that individual. That individual. You picked them. You, you married, married them. You, you married, married Not only did you pick them, you went down to the courthouse, you signed papers. Exactly. And you said, under God. Exactly. Under God, you made a promise of three, a cord of, of, of three with mm -hmm. God and you and her mm -hmm. to, to make this happen. So that's that's on you. Okay? Mm -hmm. So this is what you got to deal with. <laughs> this you got to deal you, with it. You got to deal with it. But yeah. I'm not saying just keep taking it. Yeah. But assess the situation and then find out what can be done about it. Mm -hmm. Okay? So... As we wrap it up, getting into our, do we wrap it up with something yeah. or do we just record it later? Maybe we can no, record it later. We can record it later. Let's record it later, man. Yeah. Hey, y'all, subscribe, do like, all the YouTube stuff. <laughs> do all of that. 
Down All at right. the bottom. Click, down at the bottom. Click right. and subscribe, hey, please. Right, right about this. Us. Tell us what we're wrong, right? Yes. We, we, we want all the smoke. We want please. all the smoke. I want to hear what y'all have to say. Tell, tell me what, you, have what to you, you think about what we had to say. Exactly. Whether you think we hey, hey, man. We're with it. We're with it. Right here on the D&D Leveling, D &D Leveling Up, Up Podcast. Yes. All right? All right. Peace. Deuces. Yeah. I know that's getting ready to stop me, man. Huh? The the what you call it? The that was video. dope though. Yeah, it man. Going on a little longer too. Right. Yeah, but we gotta we gotta get something with a little. <laughs> we gotta. <laughs> this should have been a topic by itself. I mean, it still could be. You could just release. And like I was saying before, remember, you could always release just one podcast itself. Like I feel like this segment was a little bit better than the first segment. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it was okay. I felt like this had more passion in it. I felt like you have more passion, <laughs> have more have, passion I, for I, this. I, I more, passion. Passion, more passion, more history, more experience. Yeah. So you can so you can speak on it more passionately. True. True. And, and um and then limp. In limp. So true. it was like okay, yeah, okay, okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. okay. No, 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 something, something to talk about, man. We got to get into more uh -huh. more relationship type of stuff, bro. Yeah, it and, could you be. Know, it, it could be, be a whole 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 thing. A whole thing. Maybe we just stick to that. Yeah, we could do that as a relationship month. We need, we need to get somewhere. Yeah, we you know what I'm saying? We could do this. We could take a topic and just like, okay, this month is relationship month. You know what I'm saying? And then we're just gonna take. We need to get a female in here. And get get her, somebody with they with they perspective on what's perspective going on. Perspective on what's going on. Or they can have them. Re they have them listen to this. Look at this podcast and give us rebuttal on stuff. Well, I thought when you were telling about this and this and this, because you know that can't uh -huh. heat it up. Yeah, then we can expand on it and do another park. Exactly. Another park exactly. You need bro, to get bro, some, bro. 